Hey guys, welcome back. Bart here. Um, as most of you probably know, welcome in my new metal workshop. And I moved in here about a month ago and got all the walls uh, finished, got all the machines in here. Um, so the next step is uh, hooking up the power, three phase power for the machines. And also got uh, some nice uh, LED lights above the machines to have some good lights uh, to work. Um, so yeah, that's the plan for now. So no metal work, but I know uh, some of you guys like to follow me on this uh, journey of building my uh, my own uh, metal work uh, one man dream shop. So uh, yeah, let's uh, get to work. So I got a bunch of these, or a bunch, uh, 12 of these uh, LED lights. They're uh, um, almost 4000 lumens, so that's quite a lot. And uh, the nice thing is um, they're also EPAY 65 uh, for protection, so dust protected and even a little water protected, so no grinding dust or something like that can get in the, the wires or electronics. And, um, and you can hook them up on uh, both sides and even uh, can uh, connect the next uh, light so you don't have to split the electrical wiring you just can connect uh, but that that's a maximum of four lights you can connect on one uh, main line Only two wires and these are the press fittings, but I'm not too happy about these. So I will mount uh, different uh, connections on there. I know some of you will probably hate me for using these, but um, yeah, th these are, are cheap ones and I had some problems with these in the past, so I prefer these ones because then I, at least I can feel how tight they are and uh, checking them. So um, yeah, for these powers I think these are uh, uh, better than uh, these connectors and they're also a little bit easier for their thicker uh, power uh, connections that I will put in there so um, yeah that's nice and tight
Yeah, machines are running in the right direction, so uh, everything good. And um, yeah, let's keep working. So all the power is connected and um, just to show you guys how it works here um, single phase 230 volts uh, line in with the meter and one uh, three phase power um, it has a breaker and a bag that is 50 amps so that's quite a lot um, but it is divided in here going to um, two lines one is going to the uh, machine shop on the other side and one is on here um, this is the uh, 32 amp uh, connector that's hooked up to the breaker box um, so every line has its own breaker box and that has one 32 amp output and two 16 amp outputs uh, maybe I will move this box in the future I'm not happy about the position right now but uh, yeah I can change that easy so uh, that's how it works in here, that's how the lines come in and the other line is going uh, uh, to the machine shop. So it's uh, going over there and then into the wall back there. And this is the machine shop side. So again, 32 uh, amp connector line in, breaker box and it got two uh, 16 amps output and one 32. Um, I will hook this 32 up to go to the other side of the machine shop um, to be able to uh, use the machines there without uh, uh, plugging uh, the machines in every time I need them. Um, but I will, I will do that in the future. So I got some nice lights above the machines. And also on the other side all right guys lights are on machines are running everything worked great <coughs> got uh, almost 30,000 lumens in the shop and of course the three phase is also uh, really nice uh, it's always a little bit scared to flip the switch and see if all the connections work but uh, yeah everything works and uh, so I'm happy with that and um, I can use the shop right now, so uh, uh, next video uh, we'll be uh, doing uh, some metal work finally in this new shop. So I'm looking forward to that and I'm uh, looking forward to see you again. So uh, thanks for watching and uh, see you next time.